drive to the top of Pikes Peak this summer? Well, you're going to need to plan ahead to get a parking space. A new reservation system is going to go into effect. News 5's Bill Folsom has details and reaction tonight. A second trip from Texas with plans to summit Pikes Peak. This time we came just, just because of that. The first trip, wind prevented going all the way to the top. It was so beautiful. So now we're going to go to the real top. I hope the weather led us to do that. Driving up America's mountain has long been popular. Well, so the plan goal of mine is to get up top there. And now with the new visitor center, it's getting even more crowded. The updates include paved parking. It's an improvement only on a mountain peak. It's not much of an expansion. During the height of the summer season, hundreds of cars make their way through entrance gates. Parking reservations are a way to spread out arrivals. Starting Memorial Day, parking space reservations will be required. I definitely think it's more convenient to get like a reservation. It'll be easier to find parking and then again you, we won't have to like waste time just trying to find a parking spot. The reservations are for parking, not the visitor center, so people who take the cog, hike or bike won't be impacted. More details are to come on shuttle service similar to what happened during construction. There are options to consider in advance. I definitely like knowing what I'm doing and have things planned out. The reservation requirement starts May 27th. That's the Friday of Memorial Day weekend. Sign up slots open up the 1st of May. In Colorado Springs, Bill Folsom, News 5. Bill, thank you.